in a world where power tools rule. Only maximum power paired with versatility can be king. Many battles are fought to find out who is king of the tools. This is one of those battles. This powerful impact driver is trusted by the Australians. It features a one-handed bit removal. It has tried beams, a bit holder. It has four different modes to show control with power. This powerful impact is trusted by Americans. It features a one-handed bit change. Try beam a magnetic tray for different bits and screws. A bit holder and has three speeds for power and controllability. Right, everybody so it looks like we have a tie between these two I'm not really surprised and the reason why is because they seem like even though they're from different countries they're the same generation of technology from Ryobi and you know so you're going to get a lot of the same motors a lot of the same technologies some of the differences between the two is that from the Australian version is that you have four modes and that includes a deck drive mode and that's where it starts out slow and as friction increases, it increases power uh, to the bit that you're driving. And you know, that's, that's kind of the, the bigger difference uh, on the P238, which this is tried and true in the United States and people really love this impact driver. Some of the great things about this is that you do have a magnetic tray, which comes in handy, especially for uh, screws. It does have the bit holder. Uh, the Australian version has the bit holder too. Uh, but whenever you look at the, the big differences between the two, the speed selector is digital and it's on the bottom of the impact for Australia. And the speed selector is on the back of the impact for uh, the United States. You know, the collets are the same. It's it's a single-handed. Uh, something that actually I, I never thought would come that handy is that I change the speeds just with my thumb uh, pretty often. And that never really dawned on me until I'm looking at the differences of needing to change this. You can actually see that in the comparison video. 
They're both pretty much the same size. Uh, this does not have uh, a port or any type of mounting area for a belt clip. This does, and it does for either side. So what this really comes down to is they both are very capable. They can do heavy duty work. Uh, so with that being said, it's really preference. You know, what do you want out of these two? And uh, how are they gonna suit your life? Thanks everybody for watching. I really do appreciate it. Please like, don't forget to subscribe, and we're going to see you in the next video. Take care.